my channel this is a new video and as you can see i have changed my hair again so tonight i'm just having a chill relaxed night and usually what i do on a friday night i have a little glass of wine you can see mm. yes a little popcorn i might want to watch a movie or you know watch a tv show so this is the wine here for tonight. It's called Apophritic. It's a red wine. I normally, honestly, drink a white wine or Moscato or Chardonnay. But I wanted to, I wanted to give this a try. It's really very, very good. It has a rich flavor. I don't know if y'all had this before. It's not bitter, it's just right. It has a little bit of sweet, a little bit of, you know, a little bit of bitterness, so it's a mix. So y'all, check this wine out, it's called Apocritic Red. You can find us at your local liquor store or H-E-B. I'm eating some Skinny Pop. I gotta stay fit because Lord, oh my God, I'm trying to lose this stomach. It is not the easiest. So y'all, cutting back on these calories. So as you can see, I have a little, little glass of wine. I might not even drink the rest of this tonight. Maybe a little bit more. <laughs> mm. And yeah, it's a nice candle. I got this, I believe, from Home Goods. And it was about $20. It's called Beach Getaway. And oh my freaking God, it smells so good. I love it. So to, in today's and tonight's video, as I can say, I wanted to show y'all a couple of things that I purchased from the mall yesterday. And I really don't shop at the mall that much, but got a couple of pieces that I can show for y'all. So I'll stay tuned for that couple of things from Zara, a couple of skincare products that I use for my skin. Yes, so we shall see. Give me a second and I'll give y'all a little haul or a mini haul. Mm -hmm. Did I say I was going to drink them all? <laughs> right, so the first thing that I got to, uh, yesterday was my favorite moisturizer. Excuse my skin moisturizer, especially on my face. You can find this at the hiatus and i'll link this at the bottom very very good it keeps my, my skin moisturized all day you might have to uh touch it up every other day or i don't i really put on put it on i really don't put it on every day but every other day i do it's called aqua boost it has hydropeptides in it and this is worth the price. This is probably about $35. It also has hydrochloric acid in it. So if you keep your skin looking youthful and young, I will link that at the bottom of this page. Very good product. I gotta keep up on all my, my skincare. I'm gonna take my glasses off. Well, no. So the next thing, from, I don't know if I did tell y'all this is from Hiatus. I love their hand soaps too. Very good hydrated hand soap. The next thing that I have here is Victoria's Secret a little spray rollerball perfumes. This one is called very sexy. I've never used this full, like a, a full size bottle of very sexy, but I smelt it at the at the Victoria's Secret store. It smelled very, very good. Uh, I keep this in my purse. That's one of them. Um, I got a couple of rollerball perfumes. I like to keep myself smelling fresh and clean throughout the day. And 
that is what I have here in that. So this is a very sexy, this one is called the Bombshell, and oh my God, this smells so good. I, I mean, I really am not a huge fan of Victoria's Secrets of the clothes, but I'm definitely going, I might have to get a full size bottle of this. So this is the, um, the Bombshell. Roll the ball, easy to fit in your purse. And this is the very sexy. Uh, the little packaging is real cute. Hopefully this will last a while. But very nice. I think every woman should always carry some little perfume in her purse. And spray it all throughout the day. This is some uh, of the perfume that they offered at the store. You can taste it. You can uh, test called teas. I haven't heard of these. But, hmm, this bottle is pretty. Very cute. I need to check that out. But yeah, if I have anything from like Victoria's Secret and stuff like that, let me know because I love perfume. It don't matter where it is, so check it out. Um, let me know in the comments any other perfume that I might recommend. Uh -huh. And moving on to the next bag. Y'all know I love me some Zara. If y'all seen the Dallas trip, y'all will know. Zara is one of my favorite stores. So this is actually a top, very different. Not usually my style, but I love this color. This is a one shoulder top bodysuit. Very cute. Zara, I got this in a small, you know, and the funny part was y'all, and Zara, I don't know because of the pandemic, they do not allow you to try clothes. I don't know if that's I'm gonna be changed soon, but I, I really don't like the fact that they do that. So pretty much, I I, I tried it on and it did fit. So this is a good a good fit for me, surprisingly, because I really wear I, I really wear like a large or sometimes a me, I'm usually a medium, but that's my fit. Another thing that I got was these very, very, very cute, cute bracelets from Zara. These are so cute. They come in a set of three. Very heavyweight bracelets. Like, y'all, these are super, they look super expensive. So, I needed some more gold bracelets because I always wear my stained gold bracelets all the time. I'm like, nah, we gotta switch up the style. Try something else. And these are actually these are a very good price, only $19.99 uh, $20. So for all three of these, I'm very pleased. And I think if you get these, you'll be pleased as well. So definitely check out these gold bracelets. So yeah. And the next thing, I just love this. I love it, I love it. Is this black bodysuit. Very simple. But the material is very thick. It's like a, let me see what type of material this is. It's like, I don't know, like a wool type of material. But it is very thick. I can wear this with some cute leather pants because, you know, ball is here. Super cute. It's very, very thick. I think it's probably one of my favorite bodysuits. I love me some bodysuits. So that is those pieces I also bought this dress and, then, and also I'm going to link these at the bottom but that bodysuit was about $29.50 then I have this cute looking dress it's more of a summer dress to be honest but you know you can probably pair these with a little stockings and a little, little shawl or a little cardigan also pretty cute. This is $35.90. Very thick fabric. Yeah, Zara has 
and lower the quality is top notch usually. So you know I heard girl was uh was run by a man, which is surprising because the all these clothes they be having is very, very nice quality. Everything be up the part. I don't be having no complaints. So definitely check out this white dress. It's a net dress at the top. And this is how the back looks kind of like a a neck fabric. So it's not a see-through in the back. But the front, pretty good. Nice. You can wear this like on like if you go out to, you know, on a vacation or on a little beach trip. You can wear this under a swimming suit or um well, over a swimming suit. And I think this will be cute. You can wear this to like a little dinner. Not now because it's about, to get, it's about to get cold, but in the summertime. So, yes, they had a lot of stuff on sale. And I love me some Zara. So, that is all from Zara. I spent about 120 there. And let's see, let's see, let's see. That's Zara. Yeah, yeah, I went on a whole shopping street in the mall. <laughs> so, Lord, I just was like, let me. I don't, even, I don't even go in the mall that much. So, yeah. So, next, I went into Express. Express yourself. All right. So, yeah, okay. This is a bodysuit. Like a, like a, a, a cream bodysuit. I have this in large. Very cute. A thong in the back, so it's a thong bodysuit. Very soft. I think this is like a um, let me see what type of fabric. I don't know, but I just love this type of fabric. It's just it's like a like a skims type fabric. It goes to get your skin real smooth, and it just feels like it's just part of your skin. <laughs> Look, I got this in like a cream color. Then I also got it in here in a a sage type color. So yes, sage is in and it's in to win and it's, and it's in. It's gonna stay in because this is a beautiful color. Like this to go with some white jeans or some white cute little pants, or you know you can dress it down. Very soft. This, I know this is gonna last a while. These were about um, 34, but I think they were having a sale, like buy one, get one half off. So yeah, definitely check out. If you like body suits like me, I have one on right now, as you can see. I definitely check out Express. They have a nice little sale on body suits. So next store. Let's see, so y'all, next door, I wanted to try some new shower gels and some new, um, let's see, that's, I think that was, um, well, actually, one other thing from Express, Express had this cute-ass necklace, cute-ass necklace, I don't know if this is real, but... It's very, very cute. This, I need some more silver jewelry. I got a lot of, um, a lot of gold jewelry. I don't know why they sound like, it's like they rarely sell, sell, uh, silver jewelry. I don't know what's, what's up with that, but I thought this was real cute. Very simple and elegant from Express. It's like a little necklace. And this was about, I said twenty-four dollars. It looks like it's a little bit more pricey. I like to look expensive, but on a budget. So, y'all with me? Let me know. <laughs> so, I even know. I like nice things. I just like to uh, buy things on, you know, be frugal with my money and be smart about my money. So. So that is pretty much all from Express. 
Express Mookie bag. So next, as y'all know, this is a favorite store from on everybody. Bath and Body Works. Yes. So Bath and Body Works. Yeah, I'm hold them. And I hold them all. I was in a mile for about, about a couple of hours. So these are some body washes. I don't I'll have one here now, but they also gave me a little free tea as well at Bath and Body Works, which is cute. I love it. I don't know why they're doing free tea, but that's cool. So yes, this is something else. All right, so I did get some, I wanted to try these shower gels. How y'all feel about the shower gels from, um, from Bath and Body Works? Do you think they last or they only last for a certain period of time? I wanted to try these because I didn't want to get the big bottles because, you know, if you don't like it, then you pretty much a waste of money. <laughs> so this right here is called You're, You're the One. This smells so freaking good, y'all. Mm -hmm. Now this is this smells more like a holiday type of wash. It has like a let me see. It has aloe and vitamin E. What does smell like to me? This smells like a um you're the one this is so cute cute little bottle cute color also got an eucalyptus and spearmint aromatherapy stressfully body wash you can also use this in the bath so if you want to put this in a bathtub you can do that as well so this is let me see how god this smell Hold on. <laughs> this it's a little bit more strong it has a little bit more of a masculine smell it smells kind of good, but uh, <laughs> I wouldn't want to use it every day. And I'm sure this will probably calm me down if you're very stressed. Because some days, when I'm at work, I'll be super stressed. So check this out. If you want some new options when it comes to your bathroom. I don't know if I got it up close so y'all can see this. Check out that. Will the you're the one and the uh, we don't have no name, we just says you look at lipstick and spear around the third. So check those out. These are so good. So that is all I got from Bath and Body Works. Pretty much all I have. So as you can see, I bought so much stuff from Dallas. Not from Dallas, from from uh from the mall. So other stuff. The last thing was from Dallas. But yeah, this is cute. Tonight I'm just enjoying my night. I'm gonna watch uh Nine Perfect Strangers. So I don't know if y'all heard about this. This is something on Hulu that, um, that I've been watching. And I don't even have Hulu. So uh, my friend, she's a hairstylist, and she had put it on while we were watching while she was doing my hair. And I was like instantly addicted to, <laughs> to the show. Like, for real. Like, uh, very interesting. I'm, pro I'm probably right now on episode seven or six. And I'm gonna just chill. I order me some pizza. And I'm gonna relax. Drink some more. Maybe I might drink another cup of wine because I'm taking care of this Did y'all have any other? recommendations when it comes to wine definitely put that in the comments because i love to relax drink a glass of wine chill and yeah definitely check out these products and many more to come thank y'all for watching this haul and we're gonna get right into the vlog okay guys so i end up going this weekend to the pop fancy dessert bar which is on the other side of town i've been wanting to go to this place forever and it had a Harry Potter theme, and I'm a Harry Potter junkie, so I've been watching it since I was a kid. And it it was pretty much like a, this place pretty much has desserts, 
uh, drinks, anything that you would like if you're a dessert person. But I enjoy this place. It's my first time going, and it was it was kind of small but cute in a sense. This place always have, has themes such as like whenever there's a holiday coming up or whenever there's an event coming up, they have a theme for it. Um, like maybe every three months. And this is just me showing you how many people are there. This is the menu. I mean, you had a lot of different desserts and cocktails. None of them were alcoholic beverages uh, because there are kids involved with this place and welcome to come in. But it was overall a good experience. Very fun. Um, this is the pumpkin there, little animated thing. Um, they had those are the valves and stuff for the drinks. And y'all check this out. This is like a broom <laughs> that was moving by itself. I honestly do not know how in the world this broom was moving. I mean, I don't know if it was something underneath that. I wanted to like check it out and see what was going on, but I was like, okay, no. And I think they were not allowing people to get close to it because they knew people were gonna be curious about it. So yeah, this is like the bar area. They have a little bar. You can sit and have your drink and chill. And look at the line. Look how many people are there. So we did, well, I, well, I actually went by myself. So I had to have a reservation. I paid about, I think, $5 because it was so many people that was interested in this. This is a Bloodberry Curse drink, which I'm going to say is 10 out of 10. The best drink in the world. This is the desserts they had. The desserts wasn't that good. It seemed, it seemed like it was a little, little um, bland. But overall, I ate it. It was okay. Um, this right here is a drink that I have, which is like a potion. You shake it up, and it becomes like a, I think it was like some kind of raspberry drink, but it was very good. I hope I had a great solo date. This was the following day on Sunday. My One of my friends invited me to a, a breast cancer run. Um, it was pretty much an overall good event. Um, it was probably, I would say, about over two to 300 people that were there. And I think there's another event coming up. So this this uh, young lady, she's a trainer out in Pearland, if you're familiar with the Texas Houston area. Um, she's a great trainer that trains. If you're looking for a trainer or anybody to train you in the Pearland area or Houston, Texas area, I'll link her Instagram below to get in touch with her. After the walk, we had a great workout that was so wonderful. I felt so much better after that. Um, the theme was, of course, pink and black. Um, great young lady. So I just wanted to let y'all know I went to that event. Check her out. I love supporting black-owned businesses, also women-owned businesses. And this is pretty much uh, me over here dancing because we're about to have a workout. Uh, I had to turn the music off because, of course, copyright right disclaimer. But everything was good. So, pretty good weekend, productive, and I will see you on the next video.